Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. The Ministry of Defense has released an RFP on 11th April 2023 for the procurement of 439 light electric vehicles for Indian Army and Air Force along with 35 fast chargers under by Indian IDDM category with minimum 50% indigenous content. Indian Army will receive 415 of these vehicles and remaining 24 is for Indian Air Force. The existing fleet of light vehicles of Indian Army and Air Force are based on internal combustion engine which is dependent on fossil fuels like diesel and petrol and leads to carbon emission and results in pollution. To keep up with futuristic trends and in support of initiatives of Government of India to achieve net zero carbon emission, there is a need for introduction of electric vehicle with fast charging facility in vehicle fleet of Army and Air Force. In this area, Bengaluru's electric vehicle startup Praveg Dynamics has been working for electric vehicles tailored for Indian Army requirement. The electric vehicle is called Veer, which has been designed from a specification to suspension with consultation of Indian Army. Veer is a military off-road vehicle that combines extraordinary power with an exceptional range that are safer and lighter than most of the electric vehicles. Prave claims that Veer has a range of over 500 km. It can go from 0 to 100 km per hour in just 4.9 seconds and hit a top speed of 210 km per hour. The vehicle features a 90 kW lithium ion battery, which takes just 30 minutes to get up to 80% of charge. The Veer's dual motor setup delivers 408 horsepower and 620 Nm of power. The battery pack is equipped with 5000 hard case cells and can last 10 lakhs kilometer. V is highly customizable and it can be equipped with various types of mounts such as guns and even drones. It features an LCD display on dashboard that can detect and show thermal signatures for objects at a distance of up to 2 kilometers. V can be used for two main applications which will be reconnaissance and aiding Indian soldiers on battlefield. Imagine Indian Army moving ahead with a column of tanks. It would need a silent reconnaissance vehicle 15 km ahead and Veer can be useful there. Veer has a low center of gravity that gives it ability to cross the obstacles easily. Indian Army is also equipped with array of electronic equipments and sensors like lights, cameras, laptops, powerful radios and drones. Veer, which is literally a huge power bank on wheel, can be used to power and charge these equipments outside the military base. This was today's update. Please let us know your views on this in comment section. If you like the video, do not forget to like, share and subscribe. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind. We'll soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in the defense sector.